<laughs> uh, hi. This is our Q and A video. I am Arlene. And I am Anki. Great. This question is from the person that asked for Q and A. Nicey got love zero six. Have you guys ever been mistaken for another ethnicity or race? Hmm. Uh, while we're on the subject, Arin Sudradyat asked, "Do we speak Bahasa, and why did we move to the U.S.?" So kind of ties it all in together. Uh, you want to take where who we are, what we are? Yeah. We are Indonesian. We often get mistaken <laughs> for being Filipinos and Filipinas. We get along very well with Filipinos and Filipinas. My girlfriend is Filipina. <laughs> but we are, in fact, not Filipino no, or Filipinas. We're, we're Indonesian. Indonesian. So yes, we do speak Bahasa. Very, very Bahasa. little. I like it. We do speak Baha Bahasa. Bahasa. <laughs> she wants D key. Yeah, that was terrible. <laughs> but we can understand really well. Um, um, why'd you move to the U.S.? My parents uh, really wanted us to have like a good education. Uh, Arlene and I are getting a uh, good education at UCSB. She's doing computer programming, and um, I'm doing uh, classical singing. Um, and uh, just gotten two uh, masters, two masters uh, programs. Woo. So, um, yeah, so we're doing very well. Um, so that's why we moved to the U.S., because our parents wanted a better, ed better education in America for us. Sammy Poe asks, what kind of music do you usually listen to? So, I mean, obviously K-pop is one of them, but uh, lately I've been listening to the Justin Timberlake playlist on Spotify. What do you listen to? Arlie listens to a lot of ratchet music. And she loves it. She loves it. I was like, ooh, give me oh, more of that ratchet music. Okay, it's not ratchet, y'all. It's just like for some reason, I just really, really <laughs> like trashy rap music. I'm not ashamed. Not, I'm not shame. Not shame. Okay, Z Ling asks. How old are the both of you, and what do you do for a living if you're out of school? I am, I will be 22 in about a month. Arlene is 9, 20. No, I'm 19. 19. And uh, we're both in school, we both go to UCSB. So, yeah. Yeah, school. Sung Ju Won asks, do you ever fight over which part to sing? In addition to that, Imogen Olivia uh, asks, uh, what are your pet peeves, and do you ever fight because of them? This is actually a really good question. Honestly, I don't think we really fight that much, do we? Mm -hmm. I mean, we, we've always kind of realized our strengths and weaknesses. So I do the low parts, Arlene does the high parts. I do the little runs and little stuff, like, embellishments, and then like, Arlene does the rapping. So we are not shame. We, yeah. we, we, we know what we're good at and what we're bad at and like yeah. what the other person is better at. <laughs> yeah, but at the same time, I mean, um, we do push each other to kind of improve ourselves. Like, in our recent cover, um, I didn't want to do the intro to Standing Still, and Arlene was like, no, 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 just do it, it'll be great. I was like, oh, and I sang it, and then I think it turned out fine. Pet peeves? Yeah. We've never, like, fought, like, actually, like, argued about no. things, but, like, we have our subtleties, where, yeah. like, if one of us doesn't like something, we're like, um, or, like, <laughs> this could be better, and then, like, we, like, share this yeah. look, and then, yeah. and then, like, the other person would, like, no, I think, I think we communicate well. I think that's what it is. Yeah. Alright, uh, Anzu Fanzu, cool name. What's your favorite thing about K pop and what's your least favorite thing about K pop? I think I really like the dancing. I'm not gonna lie. Um, mm. like they have really good music for Visual, production. visual. Yeah, okay. So just like That's the a... visuals. Um, because um, not a lot of people in America, I mean, I guess they kind of really, focus on that in America. But it's really like, like one of three big things like the visuals, the dancing, the singing, you know, um, that's in K-pop. And I really like the fact that they try to try so hard for their, you know, con like they even have concepts during every, um, you know, performance cycle or whatever. So that's really cool. And um, least favorite is, uh, I'm gonna real talk right now. Sometimes they sacrifice, uh, I wanna say talent because <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean, like, that's, like that's, that's, skill. I think skill level. Sometimes they sacrifice skill level for um, visuals a lot of the time. Um, but I appreciate how they try to balance out all the K-pop sure. groups. Like, there's usually like at least one person who sings really well, and at least one dancer, and then one person who's like really, really good looking, and then there's the yeah, people. Who everyone has like, a role, and I think that's what's cool about Aeroflex. How did you guys meet, and how did you decide to do English K-pop covers together? 
Um, so we are actually brother and sister because we're also Indonesian. We have the same parents, so. We met. Uh, 17, <laughs> I met Harley 17 years ago, I think. <laughs> I believe. When I was just two years old. And my mommy came home with her, and I was like, she's cool, I'm gonna sing with her someday. Uh, we decided to do English Cape, so, um, I've talked about this, uh, a lot, I guess not on camera, though. Uh, one day, it was, uh, Tans I Need a Girl song came out, and Arlene was like, dude, you should totally do a cover of this. Um, because I like to do covers and Arlene liked um, to make like little English she had, she had already made a lot of English translations for for K-pop songs before and so I was like sure why not and I tried it and it got a whole bunch of hits and then I was like I don't want to do this alone um, Arlene come sing with me and then we did that one infinite cover and people also like that one and then we just kept on going Thank you for watching our videos. Yeah, yes. yeah. That's, because, that makes uh, us. Yeah. <laughs> that really helps us. Yeah, because otherwise we would have just stopped and continued <laughs> hating each other. <laughs> if you could collab with a K-pop artist, who would they be and why? Mm -hmm. And which K-pop artist has been your biggest inspiration and why? Let me take it. Me? I guess if I could collab with any artist... Oh, my, my heart... Must say FX just because they're my favorite. I mean, yeah. <laughs> but, um, like, Hyorin? Hyorin? Oh, oh my god. But I don't know, yeah. at the same time, they make me feel too bad because they're too good. <laughs> no, well, I mean, I was gonna say Ailey. So ah! It's like... Ah! Yeah, because we can actually communicate with her. <laughs> that's a yeah, good one. Yeah, I, I think Ailey is, is a. Uh, I mean, we would definitely collaborate with Ailey. Um, we know, like, our sound is very similar, but she's much more soulful. Haley, you're up there. Voice. Girl, hit us up. We waiting. <laughs> no, you, you won't be disappointed. Uh, uh, okay, and then inspiration oof. and why? Um, I would have to say that my biggest inspiration for uh, K-pop uh, in terms of wanting to do covers, it would have definitely just have to be Shiny because I, I like. We've done, I think, almost every single shiny cover since Lucifer. All the Korean ones, I think, like, or almost all of them. And um, for some reason, even though they're kind of high, <laughs> it just fits well whenever we we put it, you know, to guitar. Like Dream Girl was one of my favorites. So, uh, so Mr. Random JTV <laughs> asks, will you ever put downloads for your covers? Okay, y'all. Okay, <laughs> let's. She's the one that let's, set it up. Let's <laughs> let's let's talk about this right now, okay? <laughs> We've had downloads on our Blogspot page. It would be pmus.blogspot.com for like a really long time Maybe now. Two years. Yeah. We thank almost. you. We thank you for asking about it. For actually wanting to download our covers. Yeah, yeah. It's just okay. it, like we we get this question like all the time, so we just want to clear it up like right now. Um, all of our covers are available on our um, I think it's box.net account, box.com, something like that. But um, I put up the links on our blog spot, and it's usually in the description box. Lyrics also, and chords. Both. So that's Pretty where dope. you can find that in the description box. The Soan123 asks, where are you and what are you doing there? I don't know. <laughs> um, don't <laughs> what am I doing don't here? come swarm our houses when we tell you. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> uh, we live in Santa Barbara. That's where we go to UCSB with our family. Uh, California, um, sometimes beautiful and sunny, sometimes very foggy. And but, sad, like today. Yeah, it's sad. But Orange Green Day Sweet Sweet asks, uh, how did you guys start singing, and what are your early inspirations? Ooh. Uh, we both. Okay, we both started started singing when we were like really young, Aki more so than me. I think I think the story was I went to a competition, lost, cried, and then was like, I'm never singing again. And I stopped singing for a long time, but Augie kept doing it. Man, I was a little baby. <laughs> <laughs> I was a baby. <laughs> but anyway, that was a real long time ago. Yeah, it's mean, back in Indonesia. I mean, she a long did time when ago. she was like five years old, and I started, or when, she, and I started around five years old too. Too like even karaoke. Um, we we say we hate it, but that's kind of fun. <laughs> What are, what's what's your uh, biggest inspiration for singing in general? 
Thank you. My kokoro, my my mom. They're very good for singer laugh, and it's fun singing with him. So yeah, I mean, to be able to do, I mean, I would I would have stopped a long time ago if it wasn't fun and it wasn't enjoyable and it wasn't challenging at the same time. You know, helped us grow as singers. So. Um, yeah, I mean, our inspiration really is each other, um, especially with like um, we're not only we not we we not only inspire each other, but we also see each other as equals, as partners, and we also um, help improve each other. So that's what's really cool. It's a really cool amalgamation of. Uh, I don't know that I don't know what I'm Got that from that Samurai Shampoo song. I don't even know what I'm son. It's, it's a combination. It's a really good mix. It's a really good blend. Uh -huh. Like Blender's the original. No matter what Blender's you get, the original is always the best. It's true. Original son. Original son. <laughs> we'll play with those chips you eat. Original son. We also like Tim Delaghetto. We like Tim Delaghetto. Shout out to Tim Delaghetto. You should collab with us. Not really, because we're not that cool. Um, so yeah. cool. So thank you so much for asking us questions. Um, we really, really had a good time just looking at them, and um, we were like trolling each other with the questions. And um, <laughs> but there were some really, there were some really good questions. We were like, oh, your yeah. questions. We answered, hope we answered but... everybody's question. Um, some of those we're doing in a fact. So we'll post the FAQ, then we'll post the FAQ on our blog spot. So thank you for watching this long video uh, and for sticking around. Look at our, why, our faces. Why, why are you even watching mm. this? Yeah. But uh, for those of you who did stick around, uh, congratulations because you get a fantastic opportunity because we mentioned this before. Fantastic. Uh, we're about to ask you a question and uh, if you... Uh, Put it in our same thing like we did before in the past Q and A. Um, put it in our the YouTube comments here, or on Facebook, or on Twitter. And at the end of next week, or actually by the time of our next cover, we'll choose one the answer that we really like. The winner gets. But da da Signed 2 p.m. Hands up album. Yeah. Yes. Yes, you were like, oh, this video is gonna be boring. I'm just gonna not watch it. Well, too bad if you don't get one of these. All of you who stuck around to watch, don't tell any of the other. Like, don't even put it in the comments. Just post your answer, and they'll be like, what is this? What is this? 